So guys, I am back with another Dying Light 2 video and a patch for Xbox console players has now arrived and today we get into it all. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like it really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so yesterday we got the patch for the PlayStation. PC users got the same patch last week. It's the 1.0.6 patch. It's the patch which basically fixes the many issues many, many players are having with the game. I mean, there's uh, the death loop issues, this and the other. I mean, it's ruining the experience for many, many players. Now, the Xbox patch arrived today. Now, whether you're at work or school, when you get home, the patch should be ready for you to install. And these are the details on said patch. So Xbox fixes and improvements. Fix the death loop issues. New cases shouldn't appear anymore and the old ones should be resolved. Added backup save system that allows you to roll back your progress, including your inventory to the last working story save point. Now this is a big one because a lot of people had the death loop issues. I mean, my discord is full, full of players still waiting for this patch yesterday well before yesterday before the playstation got it a lot of console players i mean probably i'd say 30 percent of people i've spoke to have this death loop issue so i'm so glad i mean it's took them quite a while now to get this this patch out for console players i mean it's no excuse in my opinion this sort of thing should have been sorted a couple of days after release at the latest what we're now coming up into the third week of the game being released i mean i'm glad that they've sorted it i'm glad that a lot of people who are waiting to play the game a lot of people holding on to play the game will now be able to play it without any issues but either way is a bit long in my opinion but yeah i'm glad they fixed that and i like to say the backup save system now this should have been a thing from the start but either way guys it's here now so hopefully it sorts out your issue they've also fixed input lag on controller connection issues that occurred uh, when playing with uh, high frame rates on the xbox series x fix the sounds causing loud buzzing and static noises fix fast travel now works as intended after the main story has finished added stability improvements including online sessions now i know a lot of people are still having issues in co-op play too and not co-op play was actually uh the reason a lot of people were getting death loop issues i mean if you was in one mission and your game you join the friends game try and join back and sometimes guys it'll put you outside of the actual mission area and you'll just keep dying over and over again so now that's fixed but still there's still a few issues going on with co-op which i'm hoping they saw and it's not just on console as well it's on pc also and it can be annoying so yes uh we like to play with our friends we, we like to enjoy this kind of game with our friends so hopefully they can sort out the co-op issues next but yeah guys that is it like i said playstation had their patch yesterday xbox today pc last week so we all should be on the same the same version uh, 1.06 uh, so hopefully guys going forward now we see less and less issues there we have it guys a short but sweet video for people playing mainly on xbox who are waiting for this update guys if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out if you're new around here and want to see more dying light be sure to subscribe and hopefully people i will see you on that next one